Hello, my friends, and welcome back to our blind let's play Paper Mario and the Thousand Door. My name is Fuzzbear, this is Toy Biscuit Channel. And today, we're looking for Madame Flurry here with our little puny friend. Madame Flurry, hello. If you hear her, say something. Yeah, where did she go? Eek. No, out of the question. You must have come in here. Uh, Madame Flurry, are you there? Is that you? What are you doing? Uh, wait a moment. Those darling squishy little footsteps. Is that you, Pinio? Oh, it's been an age since I last saw you. You poor dear. Is there something you need? Uh, well, the thing is, we have a problem that only you can help us with, ma'am. The great tree's entry hole is blocked. There's a stupid door we can't seem to open. My beauty friends are inside, so they're in a pickle. And Mario needs those crystal stars. It's a train wreck, really. If you can't find the secret entrance for us, we are done. Oh, is that all, dearie? You came all the way here just for that? My adorable little Pinio. You know I would do anything in my power to help you. However, lamentably, I'm in a bit of a bind myself. I just cannot come out. Wow, what's the matter? It's somewhat embarrassing, but I never go out without my favorite necklace. I just can't find the blasted thing. So put, I suspect I dropped it on my daily constitutional. Oh, that must have been the thing that the uh, the witches had. The witches? Are we calling them that? Huh? It'd be simply, I'd be simply scandalized if anyone saw me without it, so I shall be going out. I absolutely must have that necklace to highlight my beauty, and that's that. Oh, I totally know how you feel. When I go out, I'm all about the accessories. <laughs> hey, wait a sec. You lost your necklace? I'm having deja vu big time. I swear, someone just said they found a necklace. What's that? Do speak up. You, whoever just spoke, do you have some clue as to my necklace's whereabouts? If you do, you must help me. Please be a dear. Find it and bring it back to me. If you could, then I'd be delighted to help my squishy little friend, Prinio. Don't worry, Madame Flurry. I'm sure Mario can help you can find your necklace. What is he? Super. This is Super Mario. You can do it, right, Mario? Ah, sure, why not? <laughs> Great, it's decided then. Let's go find it. I'm sorry to trouble you so. So we are all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. I'm doing pretty well. Yeah, I'm doing pretty well. And let's go to the door if I can. And then I guess we're going back to talk to the three ladies. Or here they are now. Build them, I told you. Let me me for listen the sketch and you had it. Oh, I'm sorry, that, that wasn't the uh, the old witch, that was the, uh... Oops, messed that one up. Anyway. Silence, you twit! Now is not the time to get hung about stupid details. We must study the sketch. Go, go. Wow! This Mario guy looks so manly. Check out that bushy mustache, how handsome. Hey, you know something though, my lovelies. I swear I've seen this gentleman before. He's Mr. Mustache! Goo! Goo! I don't believe this. Maybe this is without a doubt all your fault. I'll be dealing out some strict punishment later, my dearie. Yes, I promise you that. What? Well, that's not fair. You're the one who had the. Silence, you square brain! Don't you cup that insolent attitude with me? Ugh, this is not fair. And about that necklace, I was thinking of returning it to you, but no more. Oh. And since you caused this problem, you had to figure out how to find this Mario chump. Uh, good. They're looking for me, and I'm looking for them. I guess this kind of works out. Maybe we'll cross paths sooner than later. Looks like all the enemies have respawned. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, sow amongst the clouds. Ah, try to time it. I was a little too late.
Still can't do that stylish. Ah, great. What do we do here? I can't attack it. It's flying in midair. The only thing I can do is defend, but I'm gonna take damage here, even if I defend. Wow! What the heck was- and it's still charging? What are you supposed to do here, game? This is nonsense. Like, what are you supposed to do about that? That's just total, total ridiculousness. You got an enemy that's like immune from damage because it's flying in the air. And I can't touch it at all. And it just lights me up, like literally lights me up. And it gives me two points, which means when I go to heal myself over here, now that fight cost me five points. I'm all myths about that one. All right, let's jump on now. Uh, that was a lot of them. That is a lot of them. Still can't do her stylish. Try doing it under so many different time periods. Did his attack just go up by two? And he went electrified? What? Like seriously game. This is nonsense. This is total bogus. Oh, I dodged the mushroom. Great. Good job, Buzz Bird. Good job dodging a mushroom. Um. I mean, that fight would not have ended well. It, it just wouldn't have. Because there's no way I could have gotten to that guy before he like absolutely wrecked me. How did the enemy strike first? Oh, I did the wrong move. Well, I did the wrong move, but it still worked. Yeah, that worked actually better than I thought because now I can headbog him and uh, take him out. Oh yeah, that's not what I intended, but you know what? It worked. All right, let's see here. Don't need to go in there, that's to the great tree. Find a plant. Is it me or the, are these guys a lot faster in this game than they were in the last game? I feel like in the last game they moved very slowly. Okay, without a doubt, I need to get rid of this storm cloud. Will, will I be able to hit him with the hammer? No. Even though it's low on the ground, you still can't hit it. This is by far the most damaging guy on the field. Uh, no! Oh my god! What? What? What is that? Th that was the worst! Are you kidding me? That just wrecked me. You know, we're not off to a good start today, my friends. We, we just aren't. Um, yeah, uh, nothing seems to be going right for me at the moment. I'm getting electrified by Nimbuses that I can't deal with. I am getting wrecked by a, uh, by bad luck with green mushrooms. And it's just, uh, 
It's just not going well. And now I can't find my way back to where I want to go. I need to go re recharge, without a doubt. Like, there's no way if I'm gonna fight those three ladies do I uh, have any chance of beating them in my current status. Oh boy. This is quite an adventure right here, let me tell you. Okay. And I believe it was uh, Entra, thank you very much, uh, who told me about the, uh, the 100 floor thing. Basically, uh, you do get out, but you have to start over from scratch. So it's not like you can resume on the 10th floor. You have to go from, you know, you have to go 1 to 100 all in one shot. And obviously, you're going to need, you're going to need to be pretty, shoot. <sighs> Hate it when that happens, when I get first strike and it still hurts me. But you're gonna need pretty uh, to be pretty buff in order to uh, tackle on that challenge. Why can't I block that? Oh, now I get the mushrooms. The good mushrooms, I mean. Not whatever the heck those other ones were. That was a nightmare. Imagine going all 100 floors deep and like on the 99th floor you get like a green mushroom. What struck me? I was, I was just, I was just finishing the last combat. I was pressing A to go to attack, and somehow I ended up uh, blocking falling material on my head. I thought that was pretty lucky. So hey, you know, maybe my luck's turning around. Yeah, positive and everything, right, my friends? Trying to plant. <laughs> it's like, it's like neither one of us wanted to give up. We're about 24 away from a level up. That's going to be nice. I think I'm going to go pure badge points once again. Well, if it isn't Mario, surely my sister know you can't be too bad if you came here looking for us. Man, you know why? Because we were waiting for you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I remember. Uh, they're the ones with... Uh, hey, wait a second. Uh, what do you mean you've been waiting for Mario? That sounds suspicious. No clue with you, but I simply can't align to hunt for the crystal stars. And so, I'll be taking that long map of your ship as soon as I deal with you. Whoa, whoa, scary lady. <laughs> uh, how do you know about the map and the uh, crystals? Have you ever talked to a uh, Princess Peach or something? Well, hey, now I think about it. Uh, who are you anyway? Yeah! Those two sick names are often disappointed, but if it's just to tell you, here we are! The three? Shadow Beauties. Uh, the three uh, Shadow Beauties? Vivian, you did come up. What are you bubbling about? It's Shadow Sirens! I don't 
C three fifties. I see two, but then they see what they put back in. Wow, that is, that is some man. This this older sister is so mean. All oh, right, sis. I'm sorry. It's just you always call us lovelies, and this is a forgiven speech. Oh, you got some fierce punishment coming your way, young lady. Oh, gee whiz. I hate being punished. Yeah, that's for later though. First, we have to deal with this Mario and his friends. Uh, let's do it, my lovely. He's so rather my lovely and ugly. Marilyn and Vivian. Ah, uh, the might say that they shared a sandwich will be what they did after with the day. Uh, okay. Good. Alright, well, we got some tallying to do. Hey, it's supposed to look at us, I just sit on you. Well, I'm looking for you, of course. Yeah, Marilyn and Vivian, let's show the princess what we can do. Oh, ah. Good. Ah, uh, yes, sis. Can't play, obviously. Let's get Kumbel out of here. You know what I should do, though? We have a Voltrum. Although these, actually, can we put them to sleep? That'll buy us some time to, uh... <laughs> I, I, we got two of them. How about that? How about that? For five turns. That's Vivian. She's the youngest of the three Shadow Sirens. Uh, max is 10, attack is 1, defense is 0. She doesn't seem all that noteworthy. Uh, she is kind of cute, I guess. She might even be cuter than I am. Uh, I guess. <laughs> uh, what am I thinking? Wow, she just punched me right in the face. Um, alright, so let's go ahead and, uh, focus fire on Vivian. And we'll continue our tattling here. That's Marilyn. She's a shadow siren. Beldum's younger sister. Max HP is 12 and her attack is 2 and defense is 0. She charges up her attacks occasionally. Says here she's the toughest of sisters so it might be best to be her first, huh? Other than that, she doesn't have any particular outstanding characteristics. I I'm afraid to like hit her though. Because if I hit her, I don't know if it'll break sleep. Well, I mean, now's a good time to test it though, right? Yeah, I broke sleep. That's what I was afraid of. Well, at least I know for the future. That's Beldum. She's the oldest sister, the leader of the Shadow Sirens. Max HP is 9, attack is 1, and defense is 0, but a blizzard attack has attack of 2. She can make her partners big and make us tiny and attacks with weird magic. The worst thing about her is that sinister sticker. She sounds totally evil. I mean, she's just the sort of person you want to avoid like the plague, you know? Yes, I do know. Ha! Gotcha. Wow, didn't expect that one. Okay, uh, definitely want to... Uh, definitely want to take out the old one. But considering she's asleep, I think it's better to focus on the middle one. Which is exactly what you did in Final Fantasy IV. Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I think it's a good idea to try to take her out as soon as humanly possible. Unfortunately, she's gonna get us, she's gonna get one good attack on us. That would have been nice. Oh my god. She's going beast mode here. Quick camera time. Ah, uh, 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 uh. oh, that's a lot of experience. Uh, seven or five. Uh, the. The one up front isn't. Shh, missed. I was gonna say, the one up front isn't that much of a problem. 
Boosting my defense? Yeah, decrease damage, cool. The only problem is they're not hitting me. Wow. Worst wish ever. Um, we don't have any uh left over. So I say just continue targeting. Shoot. Come on, flightless bird. Problem is they're jumping so far, it's throwing me off. I can't tell that I thought Mr. Mustache. I guess it's time to stop talking with you. Whoa, I didn't expect that at all. I had no idea when to block that. Come on, I can finish her off if I don't screw up. Alright, there we go. Ah, now it's up to you. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, sweet treat here. I was about to say, we got like no green mushrooms, which was awesome. And then like happened like right after each other. Aha, I missed all the green mushrooms that time. That's more luck than anything else, though. So. Alright, we got this. We got this. We got this. my friends well fought level up massively done that sheep that sheep was amazing that 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 made that fight easy so maybe my luck's turning around yeah Maybe we're just a little touch overconfident. Marilyn, baby and your loves, would have won if you two pulled your weight. Both of you prepare for all the class punishments this when we get home. Go, uh, yes, sis. And we got the necklace. That's that's Floyd's necklace. Yes, let's take it to her. Woohoo! Oh, right. We got more badges. Oh, uh, let's see. Could do FP. Could do power mounts. Could get happy heart. I think power bounce is probably, uh, probably one that could help us most in boss battles. I mean, what I really want is uh, offense up. And FP up sounds like a good idea too. Yeah, FP up could save us a lot of difficulty. All right, let's get FP up. Like I said, the FP could just save us a lot of problems because we can uh, use our skills more. And of course, I love using skills. Hey, that was perfect. Wait, why is he still alive? Oh, that's right. You got to use uh, the super one on him. Or hurt him. This is why the FP up helps out right now. Because you got guys like this. Oops. Didn't see that one coming. <laughs> Didn't see that one coming either. <laughs> oh, that one made me laugh. That was good. Shoot. Oh, this is a problem. Yeah, this is a problem. I may have to run from this fight. Hey, for once it didn't electrify. How about that? Ah, 
Excellent. Uh, what? What was that? What in the world was that? Just when I'm like, oh, it looks like my luck is turning around, that happens. Now if I get into another fight and uh, bad things happen, I could actually end up game overing. The effect of the curse increased the coins. Hey, that's really good. An earthquake. Oh, so we got the item they used. That's pretty cool. What is that item? It's really, really powerful, whatever it is. Um, gear. Attacks all ground-based enemies. Why am I even going this way? I have to go through the pipe. At least we got a ton of money, though. So the money should easily make up for the, uh, the inn up here. When I say inn, I just mean the, uh, the HP restorer. I gotta avoid some fights, though. Yeah, okay, just one. I don't want a game over, okay? I, I really don't. So I have 101 coins. And let's save. And we'll talk to her with her necklace. Oh, you delightful fellow. You found my necklace. I'm beside myself, truly. But you still must have seen me. Please, leave the necklace by the door and wait a moment. Oh, splendid, splendid. My oh so ravishing necklace, I wash in joy. my word Mario isn't it oh, are you my little are you my heroic little necklace hunter well my 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 aren't you a fine specimen of man yes indeed I like how Pino is kind of hiding behind Gopala <laughs> I simply must thank you for your graciousness but how to do it hmm perhaps if I grabbed you and gave you a little sugar <laughs> here I come handsome time to give you a proper thank you pucker up why is everyone kissing Mario? <laughs> oh Mario, you are just the cutest little thing I've ever laid eyes on. Yes you are, and that's that. So tell me, are you truly looking for the crystal stars? The very same crystal stars spoken of by all the lovelies, uh, lowlifes at Beauport? Hmm, a danger-filled search for beautiful jewels. How absolutely marvelous. And here I was thinking how frightfully bored I was. It's time for a change. Is she gonna join me in my party? And besides, I do declare that plush plush chest of yours has completely swooned me. A man as manly as you must track all sorts of trouble. I want to keep you safe. So I dare say I'll be joining you on this little adventure. I assume that's fine, Mario. Flurry join our party, Aww. I mean, I have nothing against Flurry. I was just really hoping it was gonna be Punio that joined us. You know what I mean? But hey, she is definitely different from everyone else we've had. I, I just hope she doesn't fight like, um, uh, like Boo. Uh, Flurry's abilities, a primer. Press X and Flurry will inhale strong gusts of wind that can blow things away. If she blows the direction of an enemy, she can make its head spin for a bit. Hold on X to make Flurry exhale continuously. So she's basically a set of bellows. Probably should say that too. She'll probably slap me. She can also know a body slam battle, squash enemies with her, um, straight stage presence. Yes, indeed. She can also aid Mario by using her gale force attack to blow enemies away. Ah, it's like one of my most hated abilities. I don't like uh, characters that make enemies run away. That is wonderful. It's so nice that Floyd likes you, Mario. Really, it's great. And even more importantly, Floyd's chose to join us. Let's go to the great tree. Right? And 
it looks like she starts with uh with an upgrade. Am I seeing that correctly? No, she does not. She just starts with more hit points than everyone else. Hold on, hold on. Why'd to go back to that? Uh, X. There we go. Uh, attack all enemies with a powerful gust of wind. Okay, so this is not what I thought it was. I thought this was a, uh, a move that made it so that people ran away. It's not. I think it's just a pure attack AOE. Uh, plunge down onto an enemy from above. Okay, so now we need to go back to the great tree and try to find our uh, way through this. Now I'm gonna take that fight with the ghost and I'm gonna use her ability to see what it's like. I still wish the Pino would have joined us. I like the little guy. They have a lightning bolt. Okay, Gale Force. Press release A with perfect timing. Oh, I have to hold it. Oh, that is exactly what I feared it was. Okay. Okay, so she's probably not going to get a lot of use in my party. And I had to hold it. I was trying to press it rapidly for some dumb reason. Her attack is easy to pull off though. I still don't know if I'm, like I said, I really don't like those abilities that make enemies run away. It's just not one of my favorite, you know, things. I kind of wish it was just a damage ability. I wonder if she can, um, I wonder if she can hurt, um, these guys. No, she cannot. Okay. I didn't think so, but it wasn't worth a shot. Because if she could hurt those guys, she would be able to do something that no one else can do. Which would make her more valuable in the party. She's also good maybe for like hitting aerial units because, you know, because of the ability that she can basically fly. Or maybe once I get her upgraded, she'll get some better abilities. Got an email. Um, we've already read this. RDM premiere issue, report today, bringing you all the up to the moment news as it happens. We now have details of yet another incident in the parlor in West Roqueport. Outraged by the high pian pian pianta prices? Group for age 30 is suspected of violently shaking the pianta changer, age 5, cursing the pianta changers, causing the pianta changers alarm to sound, which led to the pianta changer ceasing to function for a brief period. The parlor was forced to close down temporarily. The victim was quoted saying, I am a machine. No matter how hard I am shook, I feel no pain. End interview. Shop reporter, go. Get all the hottest shopping news about all the hottest shopping spots in the world. At Pedalburg's your destination, you can't miss a shop that's been the talk of the town for the last 20 years. Nifty Shop. The friendly owner has been long thought to be the most eligible bachelor in town, but word is he's secretly in love with the girl at the end. The wise and witty shopkeeper had this to say, you only live once, so do it while you can. Shop now at good old Nifty Shop. Cooking for rookies. Interested cook but don't know how to cook? Try our chef's delicious suggestions. Today's W recipe: fried shrooms. Just season your mushrooms, saute them up, and they're ready for the dinner table. I just know. We hope you enjoyed RDM's premiere issue. You can look forward to future editions coming your way soon. Published by Roqueport Restoration Committee. Okay, I wanted to open a quest or something for us to do. I'll explore it when we go back to Roqueport. Like, um, we already need to, uh, get powered up with the Shrine's Bite anyway. So, 
we, we have stuff that we need to do. Okay. Where or oh where is the secret entrance? Where is the secret entrance? I was thinking maybe that one of our characters would say something, but no one is saying anything. Here, secret entrance, secret entrance. Where are you? Secret entrance. There it is. Oh, that's cool. I like that. That was neat. That's the secret entrance. We can finally get inside. Here I go. Hey, you're still in my catch line. Aunt Puny is just the most precious little things. Mario, I feel I must ask. Did you know that I used to be a rather famous actress? I was the diva of the stage. I was known as Madame Fleury the world over. But the filthy air outside the spotlight repelled me. So I came to the woods. And soon enough, I glimpsed the beauty of these punies in their pure little hearts. It reminded me of my own innocence as an actress, and that made me realize I shall ever love the stage. I must feel the spotlight shine on me again. I must. As you can see, these dear little punies help me find my true self. That's why I must help them however I can before I go on my adventures. Mario, can you hear me? Hey, good job, little puny. Check it out. I was able to open up from the inside. Come on, over here. And now watch, it locked on us. The time has come for me to repent my debt to the punies. Come along, Mario. Hurry up, come inside. Oh, look at this. It's like another world inside the tree, huh? And check out these statues. They must have been left by the ancestors of the punies. I wonder how many years the penis have lived in this place anyway. These are the kinds of questions archaeologists have to ask you now. <laughs> I like Gumbella. Uh, hmm? Weird. Normally everyone's right here. What the hey? Hey, Elder, everybody, come on out. Hello. Uh oh. The ex goons. Wow, who are you guys? How'd you get in here? Whoa, dude, is that. Hey, isn't he that Mario guy, dude? What? He is? Well, we better get him then, dude. But, dude, Lord Crump told us to tell him immediately if we found Mario, remember? Ah, you idiot. Use your head. We capsule him, we get all the credit, dude. Duh. Oh yeah, dude, right on. Well, let's rock this chump, man. One, two, three, break, dude. Can't flee this fight, that's not a problem. Uh, let's go ahead and sleepy stomp on the one in the back. Love sleepy stomp, such a good move. And uh, with that, we will title on the one in the front. 
That's an excellent. Says here it's classified as an enemy combatant. That description stinks. You think it means they're just low level foot soldiers? Max HP is 4, attack is 3, defense is 0. They drink these potions that make them all big and bully, then they attack. One's easy, but there's two more. Better watch out. There's special moves and items. Well, by putting that guy to sleep, it basically bought us a turn. Wow! He's big! Only problem is, as long as we don't screw this up, we should be able to fish him off. Perfection. And, uh, yeah, normal attack will take care of this guy. I put that one to sleep because I didn't know how dangerous they were. Kakura, that stung, man. Dude, maybe we're pulling back the little crumb is such a bad idea after all. And they bravely ran away, ran away, away, what well, they did, bravely ran away. Pretty slick work, can those guys, Mario? Seriously, where'd he go? But the question remains, where did everybody go? What could possibly make everyone leave? Someone behind the tree. Hey, it's another little puny. Finally, somebody shows up. What are you doing hiding back there? Come out for Pete's sake. I found us a powerful ally. Aw, look at the little guy. He, he's huge. Uh, are you sure your mustache man won't try to eat us? Aww. Ha hey, who's that? Who else is back there? <laughs> He's massive. I don't like him, but pressure danger. It scares me so barely. Now, don't worry, everyone. This is Mario, and he's our friend. He's here to help. All those bad guys, Mario will stop every one of them, just like those last goons. Is this it? There are so few. Well, we have to make two. Let me formally introduce... Mario. Wait. How do we really know this burly fellow is our ally? He might be one of them. Peanutbur, what are you saying? He's not one of them. Listen, we can all fight alongside Mario and ch chase those goons out of here. We can take back our tree. We can take back our homes. Ha. Big bad Peanutbur, listen to yourself. Trying to sound all important like. Yeah, no idea the kind of troubles we've been through while you were gone. What? What are you talking about, Peanutbur? And why are there so few of you here anyway? What happened, everyone? Well, they've been captured by those goons. The elder, everybody, including your sister. <gasps> what? Patuni? Tell me it isn't so. Oh, it's so, all right. She was taken off somewhere with the rest of them. They said it was because we wouldn't tell them where to find some crystal thing. We told them we never heard of it. Oh, poor Patuni. Well, that absolutely tears it. We've all got to look for them right away. What are you saying, Punio? We can't do anything to those giant goons. Besides, they aren't alone. First, the Jabai tribe is in league with them. They're hoping to make this tree their, o their own once we've all been driven from it. This is it for us, the end, and adding this hairy old man to our ranks will help a bit. How could you say that? You can't ha know that. We have to try, don't you see? Think about it. We all get together, we can take care of any stupid Jabbies. So, who's with me, huh? Come on, everyone. Let's pull our strength. I like this guy. I really do. Ha! Pinio, Pinio, Pinio. You'll have to excuse me. Convince me, because I think you're nuts. What's that supposed to mean? Tell you what, you and Mr. Mustache there can get the revolution started. If you can free our friends who get locked up somewhere in the tree, then I'll join your little crusade. Ha! Like that'll ever happen. Please. Fine, we'll show you. Right, Mario? Right? Come on, follow me to glory. Let's go help them. Can you join my party already? That'd be nice. Ha, I say again. Ha, by all means, help our friends. Or are you quitting now? Tell me there's no hope? That's impossible? That's Punipur of the Punies. He sure is big for a puny. Too bad his head's big too. <laughs> Do we need a heal for four flower points? Maybe. But we'll go on without it. This is an interesting pedestal, Mario. When the PDs stand on the panel, the machine counts them and responds. The ancient peonies must have been really sophisticated. That is totally fascinating. It looks like somebody fits here. Take 
Gotta go find something to put it into a tree? Kinda sounds familiar to the uh, the first game, doesn't it? Go inside the great tree. Looks like lots of tufts of vegetation around here. Stuff could be hidden in those things. Let's make sure to check each one, okay? Oh, I didn't even think about that. Got a power punch. Ooh. Uh, that's actually really nice, but... Hmm. Stop it. Okay, um, let's go ahead and sort. Okay, we had three, four honey syrups. Three attack items. I hate to use a honey syrup. I'm gonna go ahead and use it. Because I want to get this item. Even though he jumped up, we still hit him first. What the heck is that? Kill it. Uh, tattle? That's it, Yux. Says here it's a creature created in Exalt Labs. Max is three is three, attack is two, and defense is zero. According to this, attacks the M sword effective. It has mini Yux around it. So if any mini X appears, take out those first, duh. Okay, that was deceptive, the way that moved. And it looks like there's a mini X. So do I need to, um... Tattle the mini X? That's a mini X. A creature made to protect the X. It can split to two. Max is three is one, attack is zero, defense is zero. Those twerps are the reason you sometimes get to any damage to the main yucks. They're a pain, but you have to beat them before the yucks. Flurry's pretty effective. Flurry's pretty effective, really. Oh, we're pretty effective too. Hey, got it that time. Dang it, they keep spawning more. Alright, let's um. Let's let Furry do what she's apparently good at doing. Darn it! Can't stop that for some reason. I think like a fish just got off now. We're good. Alright, interesting first fight. Check these things. And then... Are you kidding me? He just sniped me from halfway across the map. Are you serious? I can multi bounce here. Ah, oh, I didn't make it all the way across. Darn it. I don't know how to do a stylish either. did a lot of damage and we got a little guy to deal with maybe take out the x-off first oh looks like I timed that perfectly because we would have hit the little guy that would have been bad to get damage up here I wonder if she's good with these things because of her gale force ability Basically supposed to blow them away. Oh, the two X's over the eyes as well. It's just small things in life that make me happy. Darn, multi-bounce doesn't work. I, it was worth a shot. I, I was thinking, what if you use multi-bounce to kill the little guy 
and then he hit the big guy, but that's not how it works. That was so far away. What happens if you jump down? You just go over here, okay. And I was seeing like hidden platforms or hidden items anywhere. So I really don't think uh, jumping down here is a good idea. Oh, that guy Peter was still waiting for me. I was like, I'm not jumping down there, are you crazy? Man, this is brutal. How much longer until we find a super crystal star, dude? Not even those puny punies can we capture know anything about it, and they live here. After all this pointless searching, I think it would look in the wrong place, dude. Oh, it's a mousy friend. Um, ouch. Elder. Oh, look at the elder. Pino, is that you? You're looking well. Why are you still calling him elder? We're trapped, and this is our dearest get rescue of you. You know, you probably could just fit through the bars. Oh, a rescuing, is it? Well, thanks, I suppose. Uh, those are quite exciting. But I think you ought to help the other punies before you rescue me. Where are the others? Hmm, let me think. Big brother? Where was I? Is that my pinio? Ah, yes, right. Your question. The rest of the punies, unfortunately, are locked up right next to me. <laughs> Patuni, thank heavens. You're here. You're safe. I knew you'd come for me, pinio. I just knew it. Of course I would, dear sister. Now I brought us a muddy ally. Look at him. We're going to get you out of there right away. I swear. You just hold tight a second. Okay. Mario, listen. We gotta find the Selkie or we're going nowhere. There's a red cell and a blue cell here. Crump must have made them to hold the punies. With gaps like these between the bars, I think we could get through though. Oh, look at all the little guys. That's Pino's sister, Petuni. She really cares about her brother. I mean, you can just feel her love for him. I feel totally awful that she's all trapped in here. Let's hurry up and help her and the rest of them out, okay? Your brother, you came. That's the elder that Pinaper mentioned. You gotta be real old to be called elder. Being trapped in here can't be good for her health. Let's hurry up and help her. Hurry up! Who goes locking up an old woman in a place like this? Okay, nothing there. It's hoping for like a star piece or something to be honest. Oh, we got the mouse. Oh, well, or isn't this a treat? We must stop meaning like this, don't you think? Hey, stop right there, Missy. You're that thieving girl we saw before. What are you doing here? Well, anyway, I heard there were nice badges to be found here, so I keep looking. Only problem is I've been bumping it, running into more trouble than I expected. <laughs> but who cares about that? Lovely to see you again. Ew, not another smooch. Who do you think you are, you total floozy? Ah, uh, the precious crystal star you're looking for is near the bottom of this tree. Good luck finding it before the others. Mm -hmm. Take care, my handsome stash, but superstar. Let's get together again soon. I can't believe that girl. Ugh, get stander. Be cool if she joined us. Aw, oh, of course you just had to wake up. Ugh, my aching. Hey, you! You're the dirtbag hit me from behind, aren't you, dude? Yeah, real fair, you scum. If I dirty, you get dirty. I'll be doing the dirty. Just you? Really? I mean, you only have four hit points, man. I can easily finish you off in one round. Oh, we got the red key! And in the coin? An Ultra Shroom. Hmm. All right, let's use some... Um... I need to get rid of a mushroom now. Uh, 
But I mean, Ultra Shroom is really good. That's the type of item that I would want to... I would want to go to a shop. And put it in storage until later. I got the red key, though. Elder, we're back. We're here to rescue. Foolish child. You know, sit down this instant and keep your mouth shut. Huh? What? Why? What did I do? Uh, listen, Elder, I don't know why you're mad, but we came here to help you. Stop being mumbling, you. Mind the elders, you whelp. Wow. How could you abandon your poor sister run off like that? Absolutely shameful. But, but, Elder, I just want to find help to help rescue you. Oh, stop with the whining. You never interrupt an, uh, an elder mi lecture. Never. <laughs> you wonder why the elder punies call you a doofus sometimes? Well, that's why. And your time to be a doofus is over because you have to lead our puny tribe one day. That day is not far off, and that is why you need to listen. Now, first of all, five hours later. Oh, several hours later, <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, we're asleep. Or else, you got that? From now on, you gotta get your act together, Punio. Yes, Elder. Yes, I understand. Bah, only answer once. But say, by the way, why are you here anyway? Uh, I was just telling you, we came here to rescue everyone. We start with you, Elder. Oh, is that so? Well, good. In that case, well, get me out of here already, criminy. The cell is cold, which is a good for a little back. And uh, there's this damp scent stench. Um, well, there she goes. Enough standing around. Oh, they're still asleep. Just you wait, Petuni. I'll be right back for you. Okay, big brother. I'll be waiting. Oh, those little punies. They're so adorable. Okay, now we can shortcut. Still don't know what this is. Did I check the other um, one over here? Just wanted to make sure. Where'd that little friend go? Ah, you'll catch up. But I think I am gonna call it a break here. Uh, thank you for everything, my friends. Love you all so very much. This is our blind Let's Play Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. My name is Lois This is your Story Base Gaming Channel. And until next time, so long. And take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.